Hello friends, this is Helen and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm gonna explain why the heck I decided to pursue modeling as someone with a full-time job. But the idea of modeling occurred to me a few months after I moved to New York. I was looking for something else to do in the city, grow like another side hustle. I'm interested in fashion. I also really do enjoy getting dressed up and then take nice photos. Why not try to get paid doing that? A life model that I'm trying to kind of follow is think less, just do it. Because when I actually sit down and think about it, all these imposter syndromes really hit me. Am I good enough? Am I pretty enough? In the industry, it is known to be very competitive and some sense it could be toxic too. But I can't let those thoughts stop me because I haven't even given it a try. I just started looking up commercial print modeling agency, made an Excel sheet with their names and requirements, and started um, preparing for it. I am currently in SFO. Just landed. I look super rusty. We're gonna spend majority of the time in SF, going to Tahoe this weekend. Um, but right now, we are headed to Berkeley. My friend Sam and Kim, who are also amazing photographers, have kindly offered to take my digitals for my uh, modeling application. I look so tired. <laughs> Thank you for taking photos for me. They asked for no jewelry too. So we're all black, flexing my abs. <laughs> okay, I'm ready. I just wanna call on you. Call money, just fall on you. Not a thing I won't do. Ooh, yeah. I just wanna call on you. Let me do it all for you. Can nobody fall on you? I am currently applying to modeling agencies. She sent me all the photos that she took. I picked out a couple. So now I'm going through my Excel sheet and just applying. They all ask very similar questions. So your basic information, your measurements. So that's bust, waist, and hip. Three or four photos. Usually there are close-ups, waist up, full length profile. Some will ask you to write a message. So just I just look into their mission and then try to connect why I want to apply and work with them and what kind of values that I can add to their agency. Just mass apply and then see what we can get out of it. Some of the application website will provide you these digital examples and then that's basically my inspiration when I was taking mine. And these are mine. I applied 20 agencies on June 5th and I heard back from one. <laughs> I look absolutely horrible, but I just received my first letter of representation from a modeling agency. Oh, that's so mind-blowing. It's absolutely crazy, oh my god. I was actually not expecting to hear back from anyone. I got reached out by them on June 8th, so three days after my submission, and it wasn't an immediate representation offer. They asked me for more detailed information, a Dropbox link to any current professional photo, video, resume, modeling digitals. They also asked me for a video doing my own measurements. There was a bit back and forth. And then on June 13th, about a week after my first submission, they gave me an official offer of representation. They sent over the non-exclusive agreement with all the details of how long the contract goes, how booking works, what is the percentage that the agency would take, how does payment work, certain things that a model should follow. They also asked me to dye my hair back to my natural color. So after some discussion, they also helped me book a professional photographer that will help me take a couple studio shoots uh, with different outfits on. For clothing, you can either choose to hire someone who would borrow pieces from different clothing stores based on the mood board that my manager and the photographer decide on, or you can bring your own pieces. We do not want to spend extra money on this, so I decided to bring my own clothes. I have to get a confirmation from my manager. So I just took a bunch of selfies or mirror photos of different outfits 
range from athleisure wear to formal dresses to a lot of basics like leggings and uh, tank top and fitted jeans and different jackets, different layerings. They mostly ask for neutral color, black and white, uh, a lot of denim. So that'll be interesting. Let's see what they say. Hopefully I don't need to buy any new pieces because I feel like I didn't realize it but I have a lot of basic stuff in my wardrobe. So with a month and a half preparation time for the photo shoot, I decided to go on a diet and have a regular workout schedule. It's the toughest thing I've ever done. I finished the whole thing while eating Dory. Not bad. Could be better. Love 